Start. Oh. Good morning, everybody. We cannot be No, excuse You have to cancel it. Oh. Again. Okay. Yes. Shway, start. And you have to skip. Severe symptoms. Also, you have loss of memory and depression. 
you become depressed when you don't have enough sleep, and that is um, a severe effect of this insomnia. How do you avoid insomnia? It is very easy. All you need to do is turn off the light at night because when you sit, when the light is bright, the brighter it is, the more you keep awake. So you need to turn off the light to make the room a bit dark for you to induce sleep. Also, do not take caffeine at night, like we rightly said previously. Do not smoke at least four hours to uh, four hours before your sleeping or your bedtime. Do not take alcohol. Still, that very four hours to your bedtime. It helps to improve your sleep, especially for those who have um, insomnia. Every individual has his or her own sleeping pattern. We agree with that. So the earlier you learn your sleeping pattern, the better for you. You can adopt it in a perfect manner in order to promote health and your sleeping pattern also. Finally, if you wish to know uh, some of the references to read about in this uh, very topic, you can also look at it right here, how to balance sleepless night, and also stand and a Karaswoski, then the Google or the website, um, reference is also there for us to learn better. Do we have any questions, please? Yes, I do. How long can we sleep at night? Oh, thank you. She's asking, how long can we have our uh, sleep at night? Uh, basically, we have hours for children, and we also have hours or period for adults. For children, I would say it is usually appropriate for children to have 8 to 10 hours, even though some children also have 10 to 12 hours, it's still very okay. But for adults, most people say 6 to 8 hours, and others say um, 8 to 10 hours, depending on the one you fit into. You know the one that works better for you. Even these 6 hours, most people don't get it, either because of their work or the schedule in the day or just because their body is accustomed to doing it. But officially, we say you sleep six to eight hours for adults. But at the same time, know your body system and know what works out for you properly. Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs>